First of all, we need to get out to our Addie Crawford. She is live near Council and Melrose on the northwest side where people had to jump out of windows to escape an early morning apartment fire. Addie, good morning, and I know you have someone who is helping alert folks of the danger there. Robin and Lacey, we're here at the Apex Apartments where there was heavy flames early this morning. We just talked to the fire crews. They say that two pets were rescued safely. One, unfortunately, did pass away. Actually, another person is in the hospital with minor injuries. Now, we're talking here with Brittany. She lives right in this apartment behind us, not the ones most severely damaged. Tell me, what happened earlier this morning? Um, we were laying in bed, me and my boyfriend and my daughter. She was asleep, but we were up talking, and we seen the window was just red, bright. Like, and, uh, we looked out it, and uh, we was like, we got to get up. The building's on fire, and we woke up his dad because he lives here with us. And we all got out, and I started running that way. And I was like, no, I got to turn back and get people out. So I started knocking on doors and getting them out and ran upstairs and banging. I only seen two people get out, but I think three people got out over there. So, so Brittany, you got out of your apartment. You grabbed your daughter, and you were knocking on people's doors, trying to get them out safely. Yeah. What was going through your mind? Is this something that you would usually think of doing? I mean, I would try, yeah. Like, I would try to save people in my, in my mind, yeah. I would hope because I would want someone to save me if I was in a burning building and I didn't know because no one on the other side would have known it was on fire until the flames started coming through. So, wow. You are so incredibly brave. Now, as you're looking at this, how do you feel seeing the apartments that you live in so damaged? really scared like if I ever move I don't know if I want to get another apartment because it's really dangerous and everything could have just been gone well Brittany How thank you how terrified was I really extremely I still am scared I'm more scared now than I was earlier well Brittany thank you so much for speaking with us and thank you for your rescuing of these people and thankfully they are safe. Now, like I talked about earlier, two people did jump from the second story. One person is in the hospital with minor injuries. I'm Maddie Crawford, Oklahoma Zone, News 9. Oh, Addie, thanks so much. And uh, please tell Brittany we're thinking about her and just uh, how brave she is uh, to help alert folks there, you know, that we're in danger this morning. Could have been an awful